So, what is a scraper account? And for what do you need it? And how it can help you in 2020? So, hello to everyone. Uh, happy to see all of, you, all of you over here. I want to make you this short video to explain to you about what is a scraper account because I get this mes message, sorry, in my DM for every day, basically. Also, I feel it on the community. Many people trying to understand. Wow, well, this is not looks good. <laughs> people trying to understand why the scrapper account, how to use it, and all of that. So I want to help you and to let you know what is that and how to use it. Okay. I uh, will try to do it very, very, very um, practical. And yes, it's not something that I think need to be in YouTube. Uh, I wouldn't post any more things like that, and I don't think Instagram will like this video. So uh, if I won't post any more, so please, sorry for that. And yes, let's start. So basically, scrape account. It's an Instagram account, fake account. It's an account that you don't really care if it will get disabled or blocked today or tomorrow. The main goal of this account is actually to use the API of Instagram to scrap the right followers to your main um, account. It means that your main account, your client account, or your account won't use so much the API. It's only um, it's more used the embedded browser. Okay. Um, now, how you can do that? Basically, you can use any old Instagram account. I use my old Instagram account for that. Like, it's not so old, but I really don't care if it will get blocked or something or will be disabled. Uh, you can open a Gmail. Okay, it's best to do it with incognito. You can go to Google and just um, create a new Gmail account. Okay, from here. Um, it's in Hebrew, sorry, but you can do it in your language. And after you do the email and you put your phone number, you can also um, open an Instagram account with this email as well with incognito. Okay. And here I'm talking only if you need one or two scrapers. Okay. If you have a few hundreds of clients, it will take you so much so you can buy accounts. We'll speak about it in a minute, but this is basically the solution for all of you who have a few accounts or not so many accounts and you can just do it in this uh, old fashioned way, open Gmail, open Instagram. And then after you open the Instagram, so please uh, make a few actions of follow of the suggested users on the right, you will see that, and add a few words to your bio and any profile image, not so important which one, but any profile image, it will be good. And yes, the last option is to buy Instagram scraper accounts from, uh, I will put you in the description from who you can buy that. I'm, also use a some someone of the community that's helping me with that i will be it will be on the description i will add it for you and that's it so yes i didn't speak about also that many of the accounts get looped on the block so maybe this is can help them as well you need to test it for me it helps with some of the accounts sorry and with some of them it didn't help okay but with most of them it actually helped with the one who was really, 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 um, who had so many issues. Okay, so let's start with a, the tutorial itself. Let's say, for example, um, let's say I want to uh, use a scraper for this account, okay, over here. Let's say I'm seeing over here too many API errors and I don't like this, okay, and I think I'm the scraper. So what I can do, I go to a social profile, I go to a profile, I go to Instagram, and here I call it a scraper. I put the username and I put my password. And now what you need to make sure before you verify the account is that you um, don't use the a embed button to log in and to follow. It means you use only the API. You also need to check this, not uncheck that, sorry. API to save bandwidth, that's good. Optimize API, this is also good. And basically this is what I do. You must also go to your global settings and make sure that you don't have the uh, options to use only the embed browser to verify the account or to use only the embed browser to um, do the actions, okay? Direct message, I don't care because I don't use it for the scraper. <laughs> Um, but that's it you have to make sure. So you have you need this in the, these sorry settings, you need to make it individual in each one of your social profile. Now let's go back to the scraper guy. Where is this guy? Over here. That's good. So now I go to the scraper. After I check that, I do verify. Maybe you need to verify the account with an SMS or um, email. That's okay. Don't be scared for that. 
uh, you can connect it a, not to your phone, okay, it would be better to another phone, uh, but to your email, that's okay. So now it's all good, I go to tools. Now what I'm going to do now, I'm going to set it up to do as much as it can uh, scrape the data. So I do this kind of setting, setting so you can also um, copy that, or sorry, I want to put this over here, so. Mm -mm. That's okay, that's okay, and that's okay. Basically, it will scrap in a day this amount of people. If I want, I can even do it a bit more. Um, mm -mm. This is the settings I do. Um, basically, it can scrap more, but for the start, I think this is a good settings to not get also the account compromised and all of that. And I think if you do follow and follow, so this is enough data for you. Okay, I don't uh, set up any timers. I just put here um, zero and zero, okay? This is what I want. I really don't care if the account will get disabled. You have to remember that. You send to extract users, you must check this kind of box, okay? And here you add your filters, okay? If you're looking for a, the main account, if you're looking only for English users, if you don't want to skip, if you want to skip business account, um, if you want to not contain any vile, any bad words, you can use this list, okay? I don't like to add so much settings over here, but you can feel free uh, with that. Men, women, females, or Hebrew, or English, sorry, the language. And now what I do, I do automatically send scrapped results to other accounts. It's already checked, follow sources. I go to add accounts, and now I will choose the account that I want, for example, this guy over here. Now, what I do also check this one to try to solve automatically the blocks. Okay, it will be like a one block and second block. Try to see if it will work. Um, and here I go to the follow sources, follow folders of target accounts. I just go to my main account. And for my main account, I just copy the sources. Okay, I go over here, here, and I copy my settings, my sources, sorry. I copy all. If you have any hashtags, that's okay. If you have a location, it's also okay. Um, up to you. And here I go to the follow sources and I pass it, add account followers. Any more sources, feel free to uh, use. Okay. And now I do check that. I do, sorry, on. I turn it on. Now, basically, if you have a few accounts with the same niche, you can also add a few accounts, yes, and give them some category. I can add this one, I can add this one as well. And you can give them some category. Okay, and then like you can know which category is that. Um, I don't do this by myself. Um, I, I prefer to use for each account scraper or to finish with this. Um, I prefer to finish with the scrape for this data and then to do it for another account. Okay, this is what I like to do more, but of course it's up to you. Now I go back to the main account. It's over here. This guy, I go to follow sources and I do uncheck this option. And I follow specific users. And you know, as you can see, I have the list over here. It's already uh, put users over here. So what it will do, it will go to the browser and it will follow them. Um, sorry, with the embedded browser and wouldn't do so much so much API calls. Okay, if you want to make sure it won't use the API at all, you can also check this option over here. Use only the embed browser and not do use the API. Uh, make sure it can cause also a few issues. I'm not sure if it's good, but you can test it. I do it only like that, and then it don't use so many API. It's just use the data. Okay. And that's it, I think. Let's say you fill this out and you have, for example, I don't know, 10,000 users to follow. And now you want to do this for another account. Okay, so what you can do, you can choose another account. You can add another scraper, sorry. Or you can just clean the history. I can go here. I can just stop the account. One sec, I stop it and I can clear all. And I also uh, go to the extract users, 
I have the scrap history, I clean it and I can add another sources over here and just over here to add the right new account. Add account, you can add the one that you want. And basically that's it, we'll do it as well. You just need to go again to the account and follow specific users. Don't forget this part because a lot of you forget about to check this box of um, the specific users, okay? You must check this box, okay? Now, one disadvantage, hey, <laughs> one disadvantage I must tell you about this method that you cannot see the statistics. You cannot know what is your um, fallback ratio, okay? And this is not so fun, I know, um, but this is what you, you cannot eat the cake, you know, and like eat it all. <laughs> I don't say it in, in English, sorry. But for example, in this account, we have some really nice fallback ratio. Um, but if I will use the scraper over here, so I wouldn't know, okay, because it's specific users. So this is disadvantage, and it also takes some time to do all of what I show you now for each account. But I really recommend to check it if you have um, accounts with many issues. So just check it. Let me know over here in the comments if it's work for you. And I think that's it. Before we finish small CTA, just a small one, I will open a, the Java community, the, the VIP membership club on this week, and I will post everything over here on the group. You will have all the details, okay? It will be open only for 15 people for the start. Um, I'm not going to tell everything, but it will be a lot, a lot of fun. And I hope this video helps you. Please comment and let me know. Thank you, guys. Goodbye.